Hey, good afternoon. Chuck here with Apple Drains. You know, uh, my brother's down here visiting us, and like I said, we have some property here. He's got his totally self-contained unit on his side of the property, and he watched the, uh, the jet well video. He's got everything over there except water. He's got a huge solar battery bank. It works great, but he doesn't have water. He watched the video, and take a look at this. He's actually putting this well together. I'm just going to give you a little bit of the footage. It works. Take a look. So in order for him to have water for the pressure washer, he had to run hose from the RV all the way back here to his property. So he basically took all of my garden hose plus one that he bought, and he can see how far this is. I mean, it's, I don't know, 400 feet plus to get back here. But he's so excited, he's going to jet a new well. And you know, he watched the video, and he said, I can do that. And he definitely needs water over here. So, you know, hopefully he gets water. I'm going to show you some footage of that. We're still walking back here. It's a long walk, and you can see all this garden hose. It, I just think it's hilarious. But <laughs> anyways. So he's also making a video, and he'll post it on his channel. Um, it's also, you know, a rainwater drainage channel. It's called At Atlantic Drain. Atlantic Drain. And I'll put a link up here for you for that as well. He's got some great videos and how-to. Um, you know, he's working in Columbus, Ohio, and it's a lot different than, you know, down here in Florida and different than North Carolina as well. So, but we're still walking back here, as you can see, <laughs> it's a long ways to get all the way back here to where he's sinking this well. And we're almost there. Take a look. He's got everything set up and he's already got some of it started. So at this point, he's already got the... 10 foot of the SDR 35, that's kind of the guide shaft. He's already got that down into the ground. And now what he's doing, he's beginning to drill the well. And he's put a, a, together a 20 foot section of two inch pipe. Remember that there's teeth cut at the bottom so you can make it a drill bit. Next, he's gonna go ahead and add that mini jetter and use the pressure washer to go ahead and start to drill. Really cool, I mean, like I said, I'm just letting this video run. I walked over here, um, I've got some paperwork to do, so I'm just gonna shoot a little bit of this. And he probably won't get to the point of putting the pump on there today, but he'll get this well done. He was so excited, it was just so great to see, you know, even though he's my brother, he's a viewer of the channel. And he's actually taken the advice and watched the video. He says, I can do that. And sure enough, he's gonna do it. I had a few comments and quite a few emails of people wanting to actually you know, see this pipe go down into the ground. And when I made my video, it's pretty hard to do by yourself to shoot this video when you're up this high, showing that pipe how quickly it goes down into the ground. And with a little bit of twisting and that jet pump is running, that jetter, the mini jetter is cutting, it's, it's digging itself down into the sand. You can see the water bubbling up out of there. And Within just a few minutes here, he's going to be pretty far down. It doesn't take long. I'll speed the video up because it is kind of long. I mean, it might be 10, 15 minutes. But it's really an easy way to, to drill the well. Fastest way I know. If you need more detail, you can go back and watch you know, my video of how to jet the well. It's, it's complete. It has all of the parts and everything that you need to do this. As well as you know actually plumbing and hooking up the well pump, including the electrical. So there's quite a bit of information here from both of us. And don't forget to check out Chris's channel, Atlantic Drain. And once he posts post his video, he'll have even more information for you on how to do this. I'd like to take the time real quick just to thank all of the people that send me their videos and their pictures of how they install the French drains. You guys are doing so great. There's a lot of information out here on the web, and I know that you research all of it. Then you make your decisions and you install your drains. It's really great to see what you guys come up with and to know that it works so well. It just makes me feel so good. And I know I say it a lot, but if you make a mistake, we've got your back, no matter what. You can use our live help, and I can help you correct any problem that you have I can help you with project planning as well, uh, what materials you know, are the best, what works the best in any 
uh, part of the country, it doesn't matter, or the world for that matter. So I just you know walked over there to take a look. I sh show you that video. Um, he's he's making great progress. This thing really works quick. It's been about 10 or 15 minutes since he started. He's down 15, 20 feet. I'm not sure exactly where he's at there, but we'll follow that. Um, I don't know if he'll get to putting the pump together today, but he'll probably get the well drilled. And I'll walk back over there in a little bit. Got to do some paperwork because I just got back to the office. But take a look at that. It's, it, I think you guys are going to really like if you want to drill a well, this is the fastest way I can find to drill a well. Okay, so I just walked back over here to check on him. And he's done drilling. This is his well point. You saw the check valve there. And he's getting ready to go ahead and, and install the one inch pipe with the well point down through the two inch shaft. He said that he was so amazed. It went so quickly. He actually hit a big pocket of water and the, the two inch dropped just like butter down through there. Really a great way to jet a well using the pressure washer and the mini jet. So I came back over to actually Chris came over and brought me back over here. He's down 30 feet and he's ready to put together the well point and the check bow. He's doing that right now. He's going to slide that down there and then he's going to pull this 30 feet of pipe up out of here can you see the difference of the sand you see that over there that's kind of got a lot of peat moss it's like red not clay but it's got peat moss, peat moss mixed into it and over here we've just got nice white really white sand so he knows and we know that this is down into a big pocket of water down there insert our well point insert our well <laughs> can't say well point Insert the well point. And just, you know, make sure that your brass fittings and whatever fittings you have go right down through that two inch. And you can see I've got, must be at a, there we go. Kind of caught up on where I have a coupling there down 10 feet. It's getting exciting. Not long and we'll have well water here on the property. All right, that went all the way down into the coupling. We'll let that set up for a moment and then we'll continue it down through the two inch. Right, so take off my safety here. Let this thing go ahead and go down into the well. Keep pulling. Keep pulling. Just gotta wiggle it. quick when you see the bottom. Nice. So we pulled off the two inch drill shaft and now we've got the well point down in there and it's solid at the bottom looking good. So maybe tomorrow he'll get that pump out and hook this up. Hey, this is Chuck with Apple Drains reminding you but if you believe you can do something, I guarantee you can do it. Have a great day.